I go following my example. Okay, Michael didn't mean to kill Claudia. I was there, Jason. That kid was scared to death. I understand. But I am respected for what I do. So Michael thinks that killing is, is worthy of respect. But you do what you do out of loyalty. Listen to you. You always justify the violence because you care about me. Well, I'm selfish that way. I can't help it. You've saved me and, and mine so many times that I'm I'm grateful and I don't really okay, care how it happened. Okay, but when you make happened. excuses for me, you give Michael the idea that what I do is okay and it's not okay, Carly. Why are you putting all the blame on your shoulders? I, I feel like I'm the only one who's troubled about Michael not seemingly to care that he killed Claudia at all. You know, I'm troubled. I'm scared to death for Michael. And you know what, if you could turn things around by, by leaving the business or taking some vow to be a pacifist, I would be cheering you on, but that's not going to happen. Michael's making his own decisions and he's emulating Sonny. And we both know Sonny's but not going to change. I, I want to be someone that Michael looks up to. I don't want him to think I'm special just because my hand doesn't shake when I shoot somebody. So much, and I think what you're doing for Michael is beautiful. I do. My God, I don't want you to risk your own life. Sonny, about my decision. You realize if you try to do this for Michael, you could be putting you and Sonny okay, in a lot of danger. Let's with if this truce goes through. There's that much less to worry about right now. And if it doesn't go through, I'm gonna need to figure something out. Please don't ignore the good that you've done. If it weren't for you, I might have lost my chance to be Michael's mother. I mean, you were everything to him. And even after Sonny took Michael as his own, it was your love and your patience that gave Michael all of his best qualities. And you've been so special to Morgan. I mean, don't underestimate what you've done for my kids and how you've helped them, please. Tons of mistakes. But you are not one of them. Hello. Nobody knows the truth about Claudia. I tried to keep you out of this, right? Yeah, uh, deniability. He wished to protect me from the inquiries of law enforcement who would no doubt look unfavorably on Claudia's disappearance. I really need your expertise right now. Well, yeah, uh, of course. I'm, I'm happy to shed my cloak of ignorance and help in any way I can. Okay, whatever I say to you, you cannot repeat. You understand that? Not even to Maxie. You can be completely confident in my silence. Uh, this arrived in the morning's post, yes? It appears to be a photograph of a woman. Claudia. Deceased. On, on the floor of a somewhat rustic cabin. That's where she died. 
But I can only surmise that this is the same cabin where the Valkyrie had her baby. Claudia helped Carly deliver her baby, and then Claudia tried to steal the baby. Well, it is most fortuitous that you arrived in time to stop her. It was Michael who stopped her. unaccompanied in the cabin. I didn't see anybody watching. I'm not even sure what they saw. So we have very little to go on. <sighs> okay. Um, why don't you start with the camera that, that may have taken this photo and then uh, and then the paper that it was printed on and then trace the envelopes. No, just, do what, just do what you do. Right. Just... I trace these items back to the source and with our due diligence and a little bit of luck, maybe it leads us back to the person who took this photograph. of digital megapixelation coupled with an elevated level of resolution which necessitates the use of equipment not available to the general public which infers a specialized supplier. finally have been hired on a case that does not involve cheating spouses. We are going to provide security for an exhibit arranged by Kate Howard at a pro -at gallery on 3rd. <sighs> Hello? <laughs> I mean, do you have any idea what this means? This is like A-list work for a PI. If this works out, it puts us in a whole different league. No more cheesy motel stakeouts. No more strip clubs. No more really bad outfits. Spinelli... I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. What? 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 The case. Security work. Yes, well, I, I'm unavailable at present and for the foreseeable future. I'm working on something for Stone Cold. Why? What happened? This arrived in the morning mail, addressed to Jason Morgan. She asked me what I would do if a cop uh, had evidence against me. Well, Lucky, is she worried about Lucky? The cops, they, they can't help. No, they left nothing to the cabinet. And Dominic double-checked. Somebody knows something. Original came into my mail this morning. <sighs> Claudia, even dead, she's nothing but trouble. working on tracing the envelope and the picture. Could this person know that Michael killed Claudia? <sighs> the picture had to be taken after Sam and I got everyone out of the cabin and before I came back with Max Milo and I got rid of the body. You sure? Yeah, I'm sure the picture was sent to me, so this person most likely believes that I'm the one who killed Claudia. Find this guy before he goes to the cops, before anybody gets an idea that Michael was involved. Make sure whoever took this picture does not get a chance to tell anyone what he knows. Spinelli filled man. He has a lead on the camera he used to take the photograph. Apparently it was professional equipment. Okay, I, I want to go over that night again, okay? Everything, I, I'm, everything that either one of us saw while we were at the cabin, because whoever took that picture had to get in and out very fast. Okay, so you're thinking maybe that there was a car involved uh, or a cabin nearby? I, I don't know. We need to check that because obviously I missed something that night. Well, clearly, Jason, Michael had just killed Claudia and Carly gave birth. I don't think any of us were really thinking you straight know, that Sam, night. but it was my job to make sure it was clean, that, that, that it ended there that night. I need to know who took this picture and why. What if it was just random? What, what if somebody came up to the cabin by accident, snapped a photo of you, Max and Milo, leaving, returning to take the body, even if they didn't recognize you at first? They're, they're going to figure out who you are. It's somebody not going to be hard. Been following Sonny's limo. They could have been following Michael's car. It doesn't even matter. We have so many enemies that anybody could have been watching and waiting for something like this to fall in their lap. 
Yeah, but Jason, my experience with blackmail tells me that this is just the start. Whoever took this photo wants you to know that they know. Your agent calling. I can't tell you how pleased I'd be if you actually picked up the phone. I can't for the life of me see why you want to exhibit in upstate New York, even with Kate Howard as a sponsor, but it's all set. You open at the Proet Gallery Friday night, and I'm counting on you to be a good boy. No trouble like there was last time. <laughs>